Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Mario and Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. In the last episode, we had completed Chapter 7. Spawny was kidnapped by the Megabug, which is our big villain of the game. Today, we are entering Bowser's Castle. Uh, what the... I'm sorry, I'm just been slightly blown away by the puzzle. Okay, looks like that way is to progress, so we have to deal with this puzzle first. Looks like it might be ice. Uh, we got potty mouth. Ah. Okay, so I think this metal plating is going to cause ice physics. That was right. If I go that way, I land here, down, corners it, up here. Okay. So here's the first solution. And it drops there. Okay, this one does not look to be that kind of puzzle. So I need to push it this way. Two, three. Now if I push it up, because I can't push it that way, so up, over, and I can push it down to over the Bowser plate and I push it down again then it's this way okay and now it's a combination of the two So I need to get it to this gray platform. One more, then up one, over, down, circle the block around. There we go. Okay. Uh, around the corner, we have ourselves the battle. Theme with no name, too. Defeat all. Two, three, four hoppers, two bucklers. So, we are going to Battle HQ, and we're going to bring out the hot guns of Luigi and Rabid Luigi. Rabid Luigi can do more dash damage, and Luigi can do height damage. Why am I not upgrading the distance? That's interesting. Okay. So let's fight. We do not have access right away to people, so let's increase our movement speed. And our weapon might. So Luigi can travel the farthest with proper setup because Luigi will be able to get up and over. Oh, there were hidden supporters. Okay. So that might change up how I approach this. If I go here, 
have full access over there. Get rid of their barriers. Pushed out of bounds. Sweet. Okay. So, Luigi, I think, has the distance to dash into the Valkyrie. So, let's do that. Oh, Hopper. That will destroy. It'll destroy that one before I even get beyond. So let's destroy these two. Then Mario can jump off Lu. Oh, I guess I don't have the distance to do that. Okay. Let's see. I do have the distance. I could go here. And then this gets rid of another hopper. Okay. So this hopper came out, can't hit me, and is shielded. This buckler. Oh, it's because they have the super effect. Okay. Not what I was expecting. So Mario can do the dash. In. Okay, so Mario needs someone up there so that you can jump off of them. So let's put Luigi here. Okay. Dash. Jump. of him yes okay so now he goes in can hide behind the second pipe last not quite defeated but we will weaken him Hoppers can be quite troublesome. And these guys all need to move, so let's get some hero sights. So this guy's gonna start moving. He can't hit anyone. He's gonna start moving. That stops him from wasting Luigi. One. Two. Okay. So I didn't get to use all, but that is okay. Let's 
put Rabid Luigi here. Blast him away. Mario has a 150 jump power, so I can do this and land back over here. And then with Luigi, send a sentry. That'll blow up the brick. Or critical. I was actually expecting the brick to break so that I can use Mario to destroy the rest. Okay. Up we go. Okay, we have another puzzle here. So I need green on. So that I can do stuff. So I can't go this way. I need red on. Oh. Okay. I can turn this one blue. Actually, maybe I should turn it green. Because then I can step off of this one. Turn it yellow. And then I can turn this one red. Now we're thinking with blocks. We don't need the mushroom. But we do want the 20 power orbs. My goodness. So good. Okay. So this needs green to be active. But what I can do is turn it red, uh, blue. Turn this one red. Then turn this one green. There we go. That is the theme with no name three. They really just kind of gave up. Okay. Defeat all. This one's again just guards. I could stick with my current team. Which I think I will because my goodness, I'm really good with these two. Okay. Itchy feet. Increase power. Vamp, vamp, here. Send this off. Yeah. 
There's no way that's it. Ah, they wanted it done in two turns. Another round. A lot more bucklers this time. And Luigi is farther away. M might still reach us. Itchy Feet does not. I go that won't hit that hits those two that hits that one so let's do this This might be a risk. Uh, but a risk that was worth it. I'll show you why. Yes, I'm inked, but it got rid of the one. So what I want to do is come closer perfect Okay. First down. And that gets rid of their supporter. They have one more for healing. Okay. Both hoppers got me. Jump. I'm gonna land here. Okay, so then I need 
One. Two. Okay. Weaken both of them. Luigi may be dead. Oh. Yeah, Luigi's dead. Okay. Hopefully it just restarts this one battle and not both. Oh, joy. Oh, great. <laughs> so this will get rid of those three. Dash, dash, here. This is one. And dash. Okay. extra health so now I'm gonna swap out I need to increase the range actually yeah. okay so as mentioned previously it's always good to get a picture of your skills before you reset so that you can build kind of closely to what you were working with before so with this particular setup and I want this the effectiveness oh, I need that increased by one okay now let's do the fight. Oh, I needed to increase the effectiveness twice. Well, that's okay.
Because what I'll do is I'll dash. Let's put rabid Luigi over there. Here. Then we will dash jump I get rid of the two bucklers Gets rid of the one supporter. And this will get rid of the other. Weaken those two, because they're going to be dangerous. Dash, dash, cleansing, jump. Don't want to be up there because Luigi's already up there. Damage. I think that gets rid of both. Sweet. Oh yeah, Mario time. Don't do the damage I need to. So we'll bring Luigi over here. And we're gonna need that. Okay, okay. 
One. Two. Mario gets rid of him. He's dealt with. And then... Dash. Yeah, I just needed the higher effectiveness. Okay, three turns to finish that one. But we're not done yet. This Valkyrie is the Lava Queen. Blows her stack. Increase damage again. Now we have... We have to be able to heal. So let's take a look at what Rabbit Peach does. Cool down. Because it's either I bring Peach... For the healing jump, which could be really useful. Let's see. What is my healing jump? 20%. Versus heal, which is 70%. Yeah. So it will be Rabid Peach and Luigi for this battle. Am I already using the... No, why is Mario not using his strongest? Two sixty. Okay. I think, yeah, using the strongest. So 155, 160. Honey. Okay. Fight. So there are a few. Let's do. Itchy feet again and M power. Swap back to you. Okay. So dash and I can jump on you. But I need someone else to have moved first. So let's start with Rabbit Peach. We can dash against four enemies. One. Two. Don't have to worry about being up top. Actually, where does Mario get to? Mario can dash against that supporter and then jump against him. Okay. So, dash, dash, let's land here. Dash. Jump. Up here. Let's send the sentry like this. 
And then it will blow up those two. Good. Okay, next. We will dash. And jump. Land here. Get rid of the supporter. Like I said, we're only going to be doing this chapter this episode because that's all we're going to have the time to do. And we'll send this guy that way. Okay, we got ourselves... They're clearly targeting my healer. Okay. So, options. She is dangerous. These two are dangerous, but they're weak. So, maybe I put... Well, actually, I can dash against all of them with... Rabbit Peach. And let's end. Hold on. Off rapid peach to heal and this up here. So now she can't attack. One, two, three. Because she can't attack with anything but dashes, I'm pretty sure I'll be safe. And now she can't move either. So let's heal. this will get me up to high ground I forgot he had that move that gets rid of him Dash across the three. And I'm gonna park myself right beside her again. Well, I wouldn't have to worry about dashing. Yeah, let's get rid of her now. Because she is very dangerous.
I was safe here with Luigi. You know what? This will be good for Mario. Dash. Jump. Far. Send this off. Kablooey. Start with height. And now he can't attack even if I were to hit him. Time to play. And now he's dead. Well, they didn't go away, but that is the battle, and when I originally played this game, that was the hardest battle I've ever done. Because it's, you literally are consecutively doing all the battles back to back. If it wasn't for having the extra sentry, I probably would struggle a lot more in that battle. So now what we'll do is we'll get all the way to the end. Let's see. If I go down, those greens are down. I get the statue. And then I can swap them. I think that's what I have to do. Because then I go down. Put the statue in. And now I can access the other side. And then I put this down. And then I push that. And I come up and push that. And I activate the big switch. Which only brings it halfway up. And then I activate the big switch. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, activate this switch. And as we approach... All these walls open. Right at the end, we have a cannon that will shoot us. Well, you can hear Bowser. He's home. Uh, this cannon will shoot us all the way up to the final battle of the game. We won't deal with that just yet. Instead, we're going to backtrack again.
just so that we can get that impressive walk up next episode. Uh, also, did I get all the things here? Yes. Okay. So thank you guys so much for joining me on this episode of Mario and Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. Next time, we are going to be taking on the final boss of the game, which is Megabug and Bowser. I have not decided yet if we're going to backtrack first and get gold on those previous uh, levels. I have some time because my controller died, so I'm going to go charge that before I record another episode. Um, yeah. Yeah. This has been an amazing series, and even once we finish this and we come back at, to the lava pits and all the other stages with Drill, we're not done there because there's still bonus content of super levels. I'm not guaranteeing that I will complete those super stages, super hard challenges. They are incredibly difficult. It's why they're called super hard. Ultra hard, actually, is what they're called. Uh, so there's that, but I will showcase them because I've never, I've never done those challenges before. Who knows? Uh, and then following that, we have Donkey Kong's adventure to still do. So there's still a whole other story to this game that we're going to do. And we still have time. Mario Sparks of Hope hasn't launched yet. So there's still lots of time. They haven't said... A release date for the Mario Sparks of Hope game so I'm assuming it's gonna be sometime in the summer maybe even the fall when it releases it could even come out next year they when they announce it who knows uh, anyways guys if you liked what you saw please leave a comment in the comment section below mash the like button and subscribe if you have not for more Mario and Rabbit kingdom battle content we'll see you guys next time bye Ah! 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 Ah!